I'm Karin and welcome back to Our Home on Mornings. In this video, I'll be taking you guys along with me as I decorate our kitchen for fall. So let's get started. The first thing I do is decant my favorite household cleaner into a pretty amber bottle. Then I remove everything from the countertops and begin wiping them down. This gives me a clean slate to work with. My vision for the kitchen this fall is to create a charming space that draws inspiration from European farmhouse style. I also challenged myself to only use pieces that I already had on hand instead of buying anything new. I am blessed to have many vintage pieces thanks to my parents and my grandparents, so it wasn't too hard. These pieces definitely add to the charm of the space. The blue Danube teacups are part of a larger set of dishes that my family used every night for dinner growing up and that my family now uses as well. The gold metal flower breadboard and pitcher both belong to my grandmother. I truly love that I get to use these pieces in my own home now. I built the little wood stand a couple of months ago using a scrap piece of plywood and three wood finials that I purchased at Hobby Lobby. I finished it with a coat of walnut stain and then a clear coat of polyurethane. The small wreath from Hobby Lobby on the pedestal is the only piece that I purchased brand new for the kitchen this year. Fresh fruit makes great decor as well as a healthy snack. I found this Anne of Green Gables printable on Etsy and I paired it with a vintage wood frame that I picked up at my local thrift store. Last night I added a shelf above the stove to fill the empty space. I love the instant charm that it brought to the kitchen, as well as the additional space to decorate. I built this shelf with two inexpensive corbels from my local hardware store and a scrap piece of shelving that was cut to size. I think it's the perfect addition to the kitchen. Would you believe that that porcelain blue and white container is actually a vintage Avon skin softener jar? And the pumpkin painting is one that I did myself a couple of nights ago. I hope that I've inspired you in this video to create a beautiful fall kitchen of your own using items that you already have around your house. Thank you so much for coming along with me today as I decorated my kitchen for fall. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, and share with your friends. See you next time.